guys, this here is Mr. Satan. I'm hanging out here at Command Con with my boy Mice and Boo. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> We're giving a shout out. Make sure you subscribe to SSJ Ace. He's right here. He's awesome champ. And if you don't, I'll turn you to chocolate and eat you. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't he doesn't do that anymore. <laughs> Run! Morning, my Super Saiyan Blues. How are y'all doing today? AJ here with another Dunk Con Battle video. All right, folks, without further ado, we're going to get into the Awakening Medals. I'm sorry, I couldn't think of the word to think, say for a second there. Awakening Medals for the new Goku and Frieza, I believe, the, the transforming ones. So, we're going to go ahead and jump on that real quick. Here we go. We're gonna go to number three here to get some key. Hopefully we get a number a two. Yes, we did get a two. Now another two after we hit this one would be amazing. Oh, oh Vegeta, Vegeta, we missed it. Oh no. Got a two there. Got a piece of key right there. All right, versus Goku, here we go. We've got the Realm of Gods team versus him. But I'm trying to record and people can hear what you're saying. So, yeah, there's that. And now we are going right here. Okay, we got two super attacks. It probably won't be over that quick. Uh, they tend to... But yeah, I uh, hope y'all enjoyed this video today. It's uh, just going to be me fighting Goku right here. We don't have any Dragon Stones to do any summons, unfortunately, my friends. Um, I'm going to keep working on it. Uh, Monday's video will be out Monday, obviously. And don't forget about the live stream Monday night. I believe I forgot to do that this week, folks. <laughs> so, yeah. But yeah, don't forget tonight. Friday night, Fortnite. 7... 38 o'clock tonight, probably. I'll be ready to go. So, if y'all want to play, jump on. I'll probably be playing Rumble, Team Rumble. I've actually been playing solo a lot lately, trying to see how, actually, if I've gotten any better. And I'm doing pretty well. And so, I still haven't got a win yet. Uh, there's a lot of people who've gotten wins on Fortnite, and I don't. The only wins I have is on squads, and I have two wins on squads, and that's because uh, I picked up some guys who carried me, basically. So, it was not my doing that we, you know, won. Because y'all, y'all see me, I'm terrible. <laughs> but uh, I do want to, while we're while we're sitting here doing Dokkan. I do want to talk about Dragon Ball Z Kakarot, the, the new game. It used to be Dragon Ball Project Z or whatever it was uh, until they announced it at E3, Kakarot. I've seen a lot of people online and uh, in their videos and stuff like that giving that game a raving review of how it looks so good and stuff like that. And honestly, folks... Your boy AJ doesn't think the game looks that good. It looks like a cross between Xenoverse, uh, Fighters, Fighter Z, and an old Nintendo game mixed together. It don't look to me, and this is my opinion, of course. To me, it is not aesthetically pleasing. The the game at all. I do not. I do not know if I'm going to get it. I mean, I am a Dragon Ball channel, and I do probably need to get it so I can do videos on it and whatnot, but honestly, the way it looks, your boy is sitting here going, I don't know if I want to waste $65 on that, you know? And it's only from when you land to the Boo Saga, so, I mean, technically it's a rehash of everything we've known so far. 
you know? It, it, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm thinking too deep into it, folks. But it just seems to me that um, a bunch of people were losing their shit over how good it looked. And I'm sitting there going, I don't think it really looks that good, guys. You know? So, I might be in the, uh, the, the, the group of the community that, uh, that thinks that there might be like 20 people, 20 people out of like a million. But, you know, that's the good thing about our community and about YouTube and about Twitter is we're all supposed to be able to have our own thoughts and feelings and on things and such. I'm sure I'll get hate comments for this, but I'm not worried about it due to the fact that I was taught something a long time ago that I'm just now starting to live by, that I should have been living by when I was a kid. Is My dad used to always tell me when people would pick on me, do they pay your bills? Do they clothe you? Do they food you? give you food? And I'm like, no. So they should have nothing to do with what I have to say or do. So that's the point that I'm trying to make after rambling there is do what you want to do. Believe what you want to believe. Think what you want to think. Don't let nobody tell you different. Even if it's my dumb ass, you know, uh, that's the beauty of America and the beauty of us. But we won't go any further into that. We're just, just having that discussion right there. Again, saying the game is not my cup of tea. I don't like the way it looks. It looks comic booky, like they're trying to make it comic booky, and I just don't think that works for me. You know. But like I said, this is truly just my opinion. If you want to share down below your opinion on uh, Dragon Ball, uh, Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Uh, also, let's have a little uh, discussion going on too. Uh, Y'all think uh, Dragon Ball Super is coming what back in? July or October? Because I'm thinking it's going to come back. It'll either be right after July 4th or it'll be the first week of October, folks. And. When it comes back, it's going to be, it's going to be awesome. It's going to be good for everybody, honestly. Like the, the YouTubers, the Dragon Ball YouTubers like myself and Geek Dumb and Ron Style, it'll be really good for them too because it'll give us a uh, some more Dragon Ball content. Right now we really, uh, unless you're Danny, of course, Geek the 101 and Ron, Unless you're those two guys, you're pretty much doing Dokkan, uh, Legends, and Fighter Z. Whereas Danny's doing different kind of projects and coming up with different videos, doing uh, explanations of transformations and stuff. Y'all have probably seen me tweak those out that he's done. Uh, I've tried some things like that and haven't gotten any good views on them, but I think I'm going to start getting back to that because I. These are, I have real, I have fun doing these videos right here, making the, the Dokkan videos and whatnot, but the, the real fun I have is when I'm able to use my knowledge for Dragon, uh, my knowledge of Dragon Ball for my channel, for video, and hopefully give y'all something to learn. And the thing about it is, most of the time, if I've said anything incorrect in the video, uh, the bigger YouTuber guys, like I said, uh, Geekdom or Rockstar, will contact me and tell me, hey, you did this wrong, you might want to change it. Luckily, that's only happened twice so far. And, uh, but yeah. So, we're fighting. This is Super Saiyan Goku, transforming Super Saiyan Goku, we're trying to get the Metal Swarm. We're fighting him, and he is actually demolishing me, folks. We've already lost once. <laughs> One, I wasn't really paying attention. Just lost again. Um, yeah, not the best team. I do not have the best team, and it's understandable. 
but I probably should work on the teams on this uh, main JP account. I lost my train of thought because I just died, folks. So hold on, I'm trying to think what we're we talking about. Uh, Friday night Fortnite. Dragon Ball, Transforming Goku, me uh, Awakening Metals, folks. That's what we're doing right now. And he's killed us twice. Um, but yeah, I have said this many videos and many things on Twitter and whatnot, but I do appreciate you guys subscribing to me, watching my videos, follow me on Twitter, and stuff like that. It, it actually... It makes, it makes an old redneck feel good, you know? Like letting know people care about what you think and say. And, uh, I just appreciate it. I thank y'all very much. You know, y'all got me to a thousand subscribers and we're gonna keep growing. Uh, hopefully they'll have Kamehameha Khan 3, which I'm pretty sure they will. I'm gonna try to go to that. I'm gonna try to get an Ultra Instinct Pass this time. Which... I don't know if it does any different than my VIP pass, but just to say I did it. Um, we got killed again. Goku is not playing around, folks. So, we're just going to waste Dragon Stones, okay? We're just wasting Dragon Stones now because apparently Goku does not like me. And I'm wondering what I did. I, I didn't slap Chi Chi. I didn't beat up Gohan, you know, I I didn't do none of that. And this dude's just mad, just angry. Somebody pissed in his Cheerios and told him it was raining. You know, that's just... Look at this, this dude just hit me for 177,000 again. How do I beat this? Probably gotta bring Frieza, but I'm not gonna bring a Frieza race. I don't have Frieza characters. I hate Frieza. Do you understand? You stupid game. I do not like Frieza. Ugh. Stress. That's what this is. Stress. Because I've done got beat. I've done got. Wow, that's red there. I've done got beat, God. I tell you what. I done got beat two times, wasted two dragon stones. We gonna do it again. <laughs> you know, you never know. You never know. Watch me not if, if I don't even get any We're just gonna have to end this. Cause if we can't even hurt the guy, like I'm not even hurting. And he's hit me for like sixty-six thousand. Somebody should have warned me that uh Super Saiyan Goku is a little bitch. Fuck him up, Vegeta. We're dead. <gasps> we didn't die. Holy shit, we didn't die. Okay, now we need health. Or we're gonna die. Bro, wait a minute. We're gonna... Ghost Usher. Ghost Usher, that way we ain't gotta worry about taking any damage. Okay, hold on, we're getting, we're getting, getting edumacated here. Getting edumacated, folks. Do that. Okay. I think we got it. By Jove, I think we've got it. Alright, this is it. This is it, right here. He's done. Uh, Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta with a Final Flash for 480k. Very nice. Very nice, Vegeta. Very nice. Oh, he's going with another Final Flash. Final Flash. Hi, Vegeta. What does the Scouter say about his power level? Dear. Dear. One million from Goku, from Ultra Instinct Goku. <gasps> No kill, bro. No kill. 
absolute utter not coolness. <laughs> utter not coolness, man. So 60, 51. Let's go 51, bro. Alright, that's it. Game over. Game over right here. After I died three after I done died two times. Game over right here, I tell you what. Ah boy, I tell you what. Come on, kill it. Look at this dude. Goku. Bro, you don't have to show out, Goku. This is my angry face. 257,000 damage. Oh my god. Goku, why you do me like that, bro? Oh, Goku, why did you do me like that, man? Totally destroyed me. Alright, maybe it's game this time. I don't even know anymore. I've been sitting here for like 35 minutes. Alright, we beat him, right? KO! Okay. That was a long ass fight. For almost nothing. We got five awakening medals and we lost three times. No nothing like getting shot for 257,000 damage. Beautiful. Absolutely. I need to find that, that Mortal, Kombat, Mortal Kombat sound where it's like, whoopsie! Alright, that's gonna stop the recording right there, folks. Thank you for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed the misery of me getting utterly destroyed by Super Saiyan Goku. Uh, I don't even know, y'all. I did not even expect him to be that strong. He is like Ultra Instinct Goku level strength. But what I mean is, event-wise... If y'all have watched the, uh, the videos of me fighting Ultra Instinct Goku until I got a better team, he was tough. You know, because he did the spirit bomb would actually kill you right away. You had to have Gogeta or something. Uh, but again, thank you for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember what I always tell you. Be kind to one another. Bye. And peace out, my friend.